Welcome back to another tech tip by Appliance Video. Today, we will take a look at why do you have unknown stains on your clothing after washing them? Be sure to visit appliancevideo.com where you will find thousands of videos on the latest technology. For a limited time, you could save big on an annual membership and take advantage of all our premium benefits. Appliancevideo.com. Do it right the first time. Your clothes are very important and can be very expensive. So it's always a shame when you find a stain. But it is much more perplexing when you find an unknown stain after having just washed them. Many times it is difficult to identify the exact stain. The stain may have occurred while the item was being worn or possibly the stain may have been transferred from the items in the wash load. Some of the following patterns can offer some clues. 1. The location of the stain means a lot. Stains appearing predominantly on the front of the neckline, seat, knees, cuffs, socks usually mean they occurred while the garment was being worn or used. Two. Stains around the neckline and shoulders are often due to hair care products. Three, carefully look at the number of products that are stained. If you only have one or two items in your load that were stained, this generally means the garment was stained before laundering. There is a high probability the washer or dryer was not staining the garments. If it was the washer or dryer, the stain will appear throughout the complete load. Four, Bunched or scattered stains throughout a small area of an item is normally caused by leaving these garments in a laundry basket for a long period of time, damp or wet. Avoid placing water-stained garments in a pile or on the floor in the laundry hamper. The dye from wet or damp clothing can transfer to other garments. If this video helped you, like the video and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next one.